competition. We've got a great one here, I'm sure. All the signs are good, all the omens are good. The teams are certainly very good, and the players involved as well. We're moments away. Join us for the kickoff, and it's live. Well, some managers, if they lose usually, will tell you that this is a pre-season game. The winners want it counted in the records. It certainly counts for us commentators as a, a proper appearance. The goal scorers count properly in the uh, records of the players as well. It is the Number FA Community Shield, the winners of the FA Cup against the winners of the league. No, I mean, I've won this competition. I've lost it as well. And winning it is by far the better option going into the new league season. Number 17. And it's Chelsea today against Manchester City. Well, there is a favourite, no doubt about that. The bigger team should fancy themselves, but they're coming up against a, a very competent outfit out here in this curtain raiser. Interesting to see how it pans out. Here's the Chelsea lineup. Medi Benasia starts making his debut for the club. Jorginho plays with Matteo Kovacic in midfield. Morata is the sole striker today. Manchester City's lineup today. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually. They get backed up by a teammate. They hunt in packs, and you've got to do that. You've got to do it with discipline. Thank you for attending Wembley Stadium. Enjoy the game. Good crowd here, big clubs of course, the FA Community Shield probing away, trying to find room for a shot maybe. To put them in front, fantastic save. Oh, they thought they were in, but the flag has gone up with this attack. Hazard, he's got his shot off now. Got in well for the chance and couldn't quite supply the finish. William, it's good attacking play, they've got a corner from it. And maybe a chance for a goal. Corner swung in. The defenders managed to get in the way there. The shot's on. That'll be another corner coming up. And the goalkeeper plunged to make the save. Short corner. Hazard. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went. Shot's on. It's going to be Chelsea's corner. In by Hazard. Benatia! That's a decent header, but not quite good enough. That's good support play from his teammates. And now the shot! It's in! In off the post! Talk about precision. We see it again, how close it was to maybe hitting the post and staying out. But luck was with him. In it goes, it counts. And I think the goalkeeper thought he got his angles covered there. But uh, he didn't look too pleased when it rebounded in. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that. But his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Well, it's Manchester City in front. Manchester City goal. Number Kovacic. Kevin Kovacic. played by the ref and Manchester City go on. Well, they've been uh, really... but Has a go here! Kept out by Kepa, the Spain goalkeeper. Kovacic. Jorginho. With great vision here. Super reflexes from the goalkeeper. Not for Chelsea. Hazard's corner. Well, this could bring them level. 
He's hit the frame of the goal. They're just sinking back, being quite negative now. Now the shot. Oh, just saved the bar. Yeah, unlucky. Hit it well enough. Number 30, Papa Rui. To be replaced by number two, Antonio Rubiger. front at half time they're still in front match the city and they should be in front in the final sterling beautiful goal and that could just pull them away to make sure of the victory oh don't they look good when they fly in like that could easily have gone anywhere else in the stadium but it's gone where he wanted it to go that's for sure yeah that's the sign of a natural finisher that one Touch finish, it really was a beauty. Substitution for Manchester City coming off the pitch. Number 14, Emeric Laporte. Coming on to the pitch. Restarting at 2 0. John Stark. And it's Shiru they're looking for with these crosses. That's so straightforward enough for the goalkeeper. Good hands, but it's a fine fixture with a lot of history. Was the charity shield, now the community shield. And this team have won it, have won it well. They have won it well. They play some good football. And if they can take that through to the to the main part of the season, they're going to be a real threat. Well, it's a long old season, isn't it? And you end up with something at the end of it. It's all worthwhile. It's uh, Great taking part, we should never forget that, but it's the winning that matters. It certainly is, because there's only so many teams at the start of the season can come away with a trophy at the end, so uh, it's something to be appreciated, and uh, this team, for me, were worthy winners. Well, you have to have the team photo. And they're getting ready for it now. Yeah, one of those lovely scenes that you'll hang on the wall back at home.
tension in the air here. It's got all the ingredients, hasn't it? And it's our main feature today on EA TV. Join us soon. Welcome to you all. Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler. And welcome to you all to Premier League football again. The opening game coming right up. Manchester City have come relatively late to prominence, haven't they? They've had their injection of cash and the richness of resources has led to richness in results. And Arsenal have got their work cut out against the City side. Yeah, well, City are the blueprint, aren't they, for what Arsenal want to become. They, they have got money to spend and they've got a good team here and I, I fancy it to be close. They should be able to play on a wider front now, Alan, shouldn't they, with the signing of this winger? Yeah, they were a bit narrow, I thought, previously. So this will widen the pitch a bit. Should be a good addition. Thank you for attending the Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the match. Can't wait for this one. Chance to move forward from midfield after that interception. Probing pass from Sterling. In with a chance. I wonder, Alan, whether that's come too early for him. His first chance, the first chance of the game. David Silva slipping it through. He really fancied him to score, but the goalkeeper kept his beliefs and kept him out. Yeah, I mean, he'd be asking where his defenders were, but come at the hour, he stepped up there, didn't he, the keeper? Played in by Silva. How did he save that? Hey. Oh, he's got it off the line. That's amazing. Defense. Momentum in this attack with wit from Aubameyang. Mkhitaryan in behind. Opening goal. It belongs to Arsenal. Oh, you won't see many better finishes than that. But if you keep going in to that sort of area, the ball will drop for you, and it dropped perfectly for him. I think that's a lesson to anybody uh, in due the goal drought. Keep getting into the positions in the 18-yard, in the six-yard box, and you will score. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Arsenal with the lead. Guero. Leroy Sané. Have a feet there to go inside his man. Went with the header, and he's good in the air too, but not quite good enough then. Bit unfortunate. Next time, maybe he'll bury it. Last half time at 1-0. So, Alan, what about the first 45 minutes he's played on his debut today? Very unselfish out there, creating lots of chances for teammates. Manchester City wait for the referee's whistle and away we go for the second half. De Bruyne. Well, that's over the top of the defender and one to chase. He's gone for the volley and it nearly paid off. Yeah, really good technique there. Known for that kind of volley. It's going to be an Arsenal win. It will be a deserved Arsenal win. And this is a key moment for the manager. He knows he's got the lead and he's now going to do his... The equaliser here. He's got a score. It's a brave effort, really, in amongst the players to get the header in, but off target, way off target. Yeah, not his best effort, that's for sure. That was an amazing shot. Very difficult technique, and the goalkeeper left helpless. Well, he's rooted to the spot. He flew past him at some pace. Substitution for Manchester David City. Silva to be substituted. So away we go at one all. Counting down in the last ten minutes here. Nine to go. Manchester City goal. Number ten. Now Mkhitaryan. He's a very good individual. It's Aguero. Manchester City delighted the referees let the play go on here despite the foul. Good advantage. It's going to be his throw here. He's gone back, the referee, to book 
the offender. He let the play go on. It was good work by the official, but he's quite entitled to book the player now. Well, he's always going to get a yellow for that, wasn't he? It? it was a silly challenge, and uh, yes, you play advantage, but he's got to be punished for it. De Bruyne. Some options now for the pass. He's got his shot off now. At last! At long, long last, they've got the goal that should win them the game. They should have won the game earlier. It's been very one-sided, but now the scoreline has a sense of justice about it with this very, very late potential winning goal. It's a terrific moment, the key moment, I'm sure, in this match. Looks like the killer blow, doesn't it? Right at the death. We had seemed to be stuck in a, a bit of a stalemate, in truth, but this very, very late goal has changed that. Well, they threw men forward and they've got the reward. Aaron Ramsey. Well, they'll be wondering how much time will be added on, how much time they've got left Arsenal in pursuit of this equaliser. Shots on here, not far away at all. Well, if they keep creating chances, I'm sure they'll take one. That was a decent effort, you know. And the goalkeeper telling his teammates to get forward. Mesut Ozil. They could have got through there, but the defender was absolutely on top of his game. Danny Welbeck. Final whistle, it's Manchester City's match. Put down a marker, I think the expression is, with the first game, and that's what they've done here with a good win. Yeah, I think any other team watching this will uh, appreciate that they could be quite a force this season, this lot. Kevin De Bruyne was very much in our thoughts at the start of the game, Alan. Now it's the final whistle. How well has he done for you? Well, he was arguably his team's best player, so I think it was fitting that it was him just when his team needed him to grab.